Hey, this is Chris from KK Exotic Reptile. We just got a new snake today. We're doing an unboxing video. It's a surprise we got in here. But at first, I just want to show you how I set up they, they enclosures. I do build enclosures, but when I first get snakes, I like to keep them how I got them from whoever I got them from. Shout out, what's they call Buffalo Pet Supply on Instagram. They gave me a good deal they awesome to deal with they got everything you need there from bedding to food to heating to lights to lamps i also gotta keep this for the heating it's either or you can either use this as light with a thermostat you need a thermostat regardless but you can use this for the heating it's the bulb i prefer this over the mat depending on if i'm dealing with my boas or my while python i use this for all their water this gives them extra calcium it's just better it cleans out the, all the crap that's in the, the tap water and makes it natural for them but to continue on i oh this is a substrate i use i asked them it's been good to me so far as you can see it's for boa constrictors and ball python so that's pretty good. I rarely use this. I use this for reptile bark. I really don't use this so much. That's why it's empty. At first I used it. I don't really like it too much, but to, to each his own. Some people love it, some people don't. But me personally, I, I probably use this for when it's time to lay and they have babies to be later down the road. Oh, and I also do have a normal ball python for sale, a baby, she's about a month old, $60. I do shipping, um, shipping do is included and everything. Just DM me on Instagram at KK's Exotic Reptiles. You know they need a hide to use. Keep, make them keep them feel safe. I really use that but this is just for now this was an impulse buy gotta keep some leaf litter in there soon i actually about to turn this into a bioactive cage just like the rest of my cages you can see only a few of them not bioactive this cage is about to be clean that's why you don't see nothing in it so don't think i'm neglecting the animal but it's time for cleaning so i'm taking everything out i just want to show you guys this first while she gets settled. She's a little snappy. Oh, and also, that's the one for sale. See, that's the I don't want to crush that too much. So it can still hide. Feel nice, Time for the unboxing video. So now here again, shout out Buffalo Pet Reptiles for the purchase. I highly suggest you deal with them when it comes to everything. But of course, I want you to buy it for me. But they are someone good to deal with. You can check them out on IG at Buffalo Pet Supply. Add them, they will follow you back. They will do good business with you. They will respond good. And it seems they secured these boxes really well. I actually live in Buffalo, New York, so I didn't have to have this shipped to me. Like I said, Buffalo Supply Store. They got everything you need. Instead of being shipped, I can just go pick it up. This is a banana. Beautiful. 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 One banana ball python. New to the family. 
I gotta figure out a name for her. You see her tongue flicker so she comfortable, nice and warm. Little hair shy, I can see. But ain't nothing we can fix. But this is what I want to show you guys. You see her building. Another one of breeding projects that I will have, I'm gonna raise up to eventually start breeding. I picked this one just due, due to the black spots. And it just looks different than a lot of bananas that I've seen. So hopefully, we get something good out of it. Let's see how she acts in the cage. I know we're not keeping the cage on the bed. This is just a prop to show y'all. And that's it. And that's how you set up an enclosure in my, in my unboxing video. My first vlog besides the canal press. Again, KK's Exotic Reptiles you, on YouTube, IG, TikTok. And one more time, shout out Buffalo Pet Support.